exceed english grade 5 block number 13 key details and main idea lesson plan 1 finding the main ideas students will be able to infer the main ideas from the key details of a story students do you know what is a secret yes a secret Secret is a thing that is kept hidden. The title tells us that the most important thing in it will probably, probably a secret. Today we will try to find out the main ideas or the most important thoughts in the story with our secret. Before we start reading, let's understand the glossary. Gasped took a deep breath with one's mouth open to express surprise. Tourist grasp at scenic view. Glistening, shining off something wet. The lake glistened in the moonlight. Lured, tricked into going somewhere. The stranger lured the little boy to come with him. Mystery, a thing or a person that is strange and difficult to understand. The detective uncovered the mystery of her past life. Rumors, stories that people talk about but are not always true. Who is spreading rumors of my marriage to Sophia? He grunted. Terrified, felt extremely afraid. She was terrified of lizards. Students, take out your English readers to page number 67 and let's start reading it. The road into the tea estate got worse and worse. By the time visitors drove up to the house, they would be holding on to window frames or the dashboard to keep themselves from rattling right off the seats of their jeep. Yes, it would have it would have to be a four-wheel drive jeep because no other car could travel on that road. Everyone who visited Vidura and his family at Kademalai estate gasped at how beautiful it was. But after one night in the lonely bungalow, nestling in a valley surrounded by tea bushes on one side and a forest on the other, they usually wanted to pack their bags and leave. There was no television at night and most city kids found the sound of the forest frightening. What was that howling? They would panic, huddled together under thick blankets. Here the author is telling us about the story setting which is a tea estate far away from cities and very close to nature. The author doesn't write this but we learn it from details like no car could travel on that road. Turn to next page. It didn't help that when they woke up in the morning and went into the garden, Vudhur would point to various droppings and pelts on the lawn. Oh, the bison had been here last night. He would tell a large cousin from Bombay. Or oh, that looks like the droppings of a panther. Words like that could turn tough cousins into meek mice who only wanted to stay indoors. Vidhar knew of no other home. He had lived all his years at Kademalai, loving the sights and sounds of the forest behind the house that went all the way up and over the hill. He would see a porcupine there last week, and he knew that often panthers went silently past his house in the night, especially on days when the cook had made mutton fry. He had believed that his family lived in the company happily of company of animals. But that was only till Bucci. The Lhasa Apso puppy moved into the house. Vidur worried that Bucci would sneak off into the forest and get a porcupine quill in his eye. He was terrified that the ever-hungry dog would kill one of the rabbits or squirrels that lived so happily around the vegetable garden. He was absolutely filled with terror when rumors spread that a black panther had moved into the valley. Often when these animals became old or were very hungry, they moved closer to the estate, feeding off dogs. In fact, many people called them dog panthers. 
How was he to keep an eye on his wild and adventurous Bucci with a panther in the well? Bucci was not the kind of a dog that would be happy being tied up or kept indoors. Days passed and the tea pluckers who walked past on their way home always had reports about the panther. It had been seen near the workshop. The previous night it was heard whimpering near the cattle shed of the school headmaster. Yet no dogs disappeared, nor were any cattle attacked. That was a mystery. These words or phrases help us know the main idea. The main ideas were the setting of the story is in a place close to nature that is beautiful yet scary for some. Vidur likes animals. Vidur likes animals and do not see them as a threat. He changes when he gets a pet and begins to see animals as a threat. A panther moves into the valley. Vidur is even more worried. The panther might not be dangerous after all. The main idea is the main point that the author wants to tell the reader. To find the main idea, ask questions about the setting, character or events on a page. Finally, what the main point is the author trying to make through this paragraph. Students, open your volume 2 to page number 25, Finding the Main Ideas. First question. Read the passage and underline the key details. With his eyes tightly shut, he yawned and stretched his body tiredly. A moment later, he heard a scream from the floor. It was his mother. Mohit, it is 9.30, she shouted. At once, he jumped out of the bed. He hurriedly grabbed his bag and shoved the books in it. Then, he swiftly slipped out of his pajamas and into his pants and shirt. He reached out for his shoes and fled out the door. The next moment, he was in the kitchen pouring some milk into a tumbler. Quickly, he grabbed a sandwich and dashed out of the door. Underline jumped out of his bed, grabbed his bag, shoved the books, pajamas in into his pants and shirt. He reached out for his shoes. In the, in the next moment, write the main idea of the passage. Mohit is in hurry to reach somewhere. Write a summary of Vidur's secret. Include the most important thing that you have learned about the characters, settings, and events so far. Vidur lives in a tea estate with his family. Animals often come to the animals often come to the tea estate, but he does not see them as a danger. When he gets a pet dog, Bucci, he feared that Bucci and the other animals might harm each other. He becomes more worried when he hears the news of a panther moving into the valley. But mysteriously, although the panther is often seen and heard around, there is no news of any dog or cattle being hurt or killed.